Focus on Ag is brought to you by Terry County Tractor. Welcome back in this week's Focus on Ag. Just like everyone, farmers and ranchers are feeling the effects of insurance rates going up, both in property and crops. KCBD News Channel 11's Patricia Perry joins us to tell us the impacts and why those prices are going up. Patricia. Joshua, Texas Farm Bureau State Director Walt Haygood tells me across the board, cost has gone up on the insurer, causing that to be passed on to you. He tells me he knew it was coming, but was still shocked and is feeling it himself now. You know, I sit on the board of an insurance company and, you know, I was in there for the meetings and I knew the rate was going up, but when I opened my, you know, when I opened my statement, I mean, it took my breath away. A spike in inflation and supply chain issues have made it harder and more costly to fix property like pivot irrigation systems or tractors. If something happens damage-wise, the cost to repair those have gone up a lot in the last two years. As claims are filed, insurers are having to make up for the higher bill the company is faced with. They're having to reprice those. With that repricing taking effect, it's a slow process. So what happens is there's a big spike in our cost for our premium. He says property insurance has, in some cases, more than doubled. Haygood says as more claims are filed, it deals a blow to the insurance company when it all comes in at once. The more loss there is across the state or across the nation, it affects everybody. Everybody has to pay for that somewhere or the other. For crop insurance, a lot of farmers haven't harvested as good of a yield from drought conditions the past couple of seasons. That hurts their actual production history, or APH. When you have excessive years of loss, you know, then that APH gets lower and the premium goes higher because it's more risk. Haygood says it's imperative we see less disasters, get more rain, and make crops. The more those improved APHs we get, the better coverage we have and the less the coverage cost. There is light at the end of the tunnel. Haygood says we will eventually feel relief in insurance rates. If we can get to a period where everything levels off for a while and we don't have a lot of losses, inflation settles down, we should see rates settle down and possibly come back down. Haygood says one of the biggest concerns for farmers currently is getting a crop to help their APH. He says we had a lot of rain while wrapping up planting season, but we need more now to keep the cotton growing and ready for harvesting time. That's all for this week's Focus on Ag. I'm Patricia Perry.